long-term patient-doctor relationships used to be more or less the norm in healthcare, and now they seem increasingly rare. Why is that? Uh, was it due to a change in our healthcare system or our society or, or both, or how did that come about? Well, I'd say, I'd say, I'd say both. Um, I think that uh, people do move around in jobs more, and uh, a lot of people's insurance is related to their job, and so that forces discontinuity sometimes. Uh, employers bid out their insurance contracts, and sometimes there are different panels that are on that. So that's started to be built into the system. We actually studied that, gosh, about 20 years ago and found that at that time, a quarter of people where uh, we live in Northeast Ohio have been forced to change their family doctor in the last two years because their insurance changed. And we found a lot of negative repercussions from, from that. So some of it's baked into how we bid out health care. Um, Patients move some, but physicians move a lot. It used to be that people would go hang up a shingle and try to stay in, in one area. And now uh, most physicians are employed by their companies and uh, they say where you practice sometimes and, and change things around a, a, a bit. And I also think we have more and more technology. So we have different ways of getting care. We have Dr. Google, we have, uh, we have televisits that you can, uh, can do just without having any relationships. So, there's just been a lot of things that have happened uh, along the way uh, that have, I think, kind of come together to make it less common.